Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Nichelle, and today I have a sticker haul for you. Um, I just have, I just have a few things here, but I have a basket full of goodies, and so I've been trying to keep my desk pretty. It's it's this really small desk, so it's just like a catch-all, but also. Um, I may sit down and work there, but not really. But anyway, I wanted to keep my desk kind of organized, and so I had this extra basket, so when I'm getting Happy Mail in, I can just dump it in there. So I have a couple of new-to-me shops and then some favorite shops. So first up, let's start off with a new-to-me shop. This is Plana Hannah, and I believe she's known for like her underlays and, um, things like that so I stumbled upon her from someone else's video and honestly that's kind of how I come across different shops is just watching other people's sticker hauls and plan with me's and all of that good stuff and if they're if they are showing something that piques my interest then I tend to click on it you know click on that person's that shops link and check it out so I love, you know, supporting um, a lot of different shops and, you know, new people. So here is like a journaling card and then also a freebie. This is in silver. So for me, um, when I went on to her shop, I she had a sale for custom scripts. And so there are some things that I can't find anywhere else that I wanted to go ahead and get some customs done and this is so not in the right order so give me a second I thought I had these in the right order okay so I just picked up a few things so first up I was getting low on film scripts so I picked as you can see I used one um I picked up some film scripts in rose gold and then also um silver and actually I, I could use a whole nother sheet of at least one more sheet okay and then I put I write or um not write but I always do um, budget in my planner as well so of course I wanted to get some in silver I got another one in gold and then also rose gold and she has like a variety of different fonts that you can choose from so I just I think I forget which one this was but um, I just wanted to you know try out the different fonts and stuff okay now for some customs uh, lately, you've been seeing me do like weekly meetings um, with my firm. They have weekly meetings every Friday and then also we have paralegal meetings every other week. So I wanted some scripts for that. These are quite tiny, um, maybe because of, you know, of, of what I have on here, but they are quite tiny. I will say that. So maybe the next time I'll just do weekly meeting. Um, instead of KF weekly meeting. So I picked those up in all three foils. Again, they are very, very tiny. And then I also did paralegal meeting in all three uh, foils. Okay, so that is my order from Plana Hannah. And then next we have letters to Apollo. I have been eyeing this kit for a while and I think she was having like a sale and so I was like you know what this is the perfect time for me to grab that kit so and I picked up a few other things but this kit is absolutely stunning it's like a music theme type kit but the colors are just friggin gorgeous and then I also picked up a few other things as well. So this is just a small order, but I'm super excited about my order. Okay, so let's do the non-kit stuff first. Again, like I said, she was having a sale at the time 
and I was like, you know what, let me just grab some other things that I wanted to get. Okay, so first we have a freebie. I put in Alyssa, and you get 10% off, and this is in rose gold foil. And then I wanted some dividers. So this is divider 10. It looks like there's like little flowers right there. And I guess this is rose gold. And then I love this. This I love this thickness of the borders. Um, it takes up space. And so if I don't have like a lot of plans that day, I can put in one of these. I need to go back and get one in silver and rose gold. Um, but this is the scallop floral lace border in gold. And then this is divider 12. I like the thickness of these. And then I picked up this butterfly cluster because I feel like some of my kits have a lot of butterflies. So I decided to go ahead and pick this up in light gold. I think this is light gold. Okay, on to the kit. So for some reason, my mailer was a little bent. So I tried to lay something on top of it to flatten it out a bit. But this kit is so stunning. Two of my favorite colors, purple and then this green. I Not all greens are, fa are my favorite, but this combination is absolutely stunning. I'm thinking about putting this into September. Um, I don't know why it's giving me September vibes, but it is. Heck, I might even put it in November. But it's absolutely stunning. It's called Pieces of You. And then she also gives you the... Uh, uh, what are these called? What are these called? Your weekly scripts, your your um, days of the week. This is in, so the kit is in silver. It's so pretty. So, so, so pretty. I'll do a close-up in just a second. But here you have your full boxes. And then down here you have some icons. And the colors match the kit. And then you have this page. And this is why... She gives you the date covers, the not what are these daggone things called? Days of the week or whatever. So you can put those right there. Okay, then you have some deco, a couple of boxes, lots of layering pieces, torn side side um, pieces, and then your box page. It's still really bent. Love the different boxes and shapes and sizes. And then this bottom washi is gorgeous, like friggin' gorgeous. I love how the notes are within the florals. So pretty. This green is stunning. Super pretty. And then you have like some layering little shapes and sizes, a couple of extra um, headers, a habit tracker, and then a couple of uh, bow check boxes, and then two different. Um, sets of headers. So that is the basic kit. But let me go ahead and show you the full boxes up close because they are absolutely stunning. They're so pretty. So very pretty. Okay, and then I picked up the trim page. And then I also picked up the, I guess, the floral, pa floral page. And then the journaling page. Look at that box there. Absolutely stunning. So pretty. So, 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 so very pretty. So that is my order from Letters to Apollo. If I can pick that up. Okay, next up is Glam Planner. She has been away for a while. Um, she was sick and then, and so she is back. And she came back with a glitch sale. She does those every so often and I typically take advantage when she does. Um, and so I kind of went ham. <laughs> as you can see with all kinds of stuff so yeah i've got i've got quite a bit here 
quite a bit, quite a bit. Okay, so let's start off, this is the, um, she gave this like a little freebie pack here. I didn't know we were getting this. I may gift this to someone else. I did take it, as you can see, it's already open. So I did take a pick, I did take a peek at this. Um, I don't think I'm gonna keep anything, but we shall see. This is from a kit, Antisocial, that's so me sometimes, from her New Year's kit. And then her little bitties, what are these called? I forget what they're called. I'm, I don't have plants, so I would never use this. And then this was from a kit I believe I already used. And then this is from that Happy New Year kit. And then you have like a, not sure, like, okay, this is like from her, this is from her January 21 sub. And then this was from one of her kits here. Another one. I think this is a kit that I had before. And this was a kit that I had before, for sure. So I'm gonna put those back in the bag. And I, like I said, I may go ahead and just gift this. Cause I don't, I'm not gonna use any of this. So yes, okay. So if you are watching this and you would love this little freebie pack, put your name in the comments and say, I would love the freebie. And if there's more than one, then I will do like a random draw type thing for that. Put that to the side. Okay, so next I always love to get this, uh, her labels grab bag because when, I, and when I'm doing like um, my, uh, what's it called? What's it called? My memory spread and I don't have like a lot of boxes or if I'm doing a, um, my personal, then I will go ahead and pull out these labels. They come in handy and I love using them. So I was hoping that she had, that she brought these back. And I'm just gonna flip through. You get quite a bit, so add to my collection. Some of these look familiar in the colors and then some of them do not. So again, I like to pull these in when I need um, extra boxes. And again, I forget how much this was. I'm trying to think where the front was. That may be it there. Okay. So there's that. And then also the glitter headers. Another one that I like to pull in if I need some more. Especially if a kit only comes with like two sets, then I like to bring in some glitter headers. Okay, so remember this is the first page. I'm just gonna flip through. These are all from different kits that she has had. So, yeah. And there's certain colors that I use all the time, and then there's colors where I may not ever use now some of these do look familiar which i'm not mad about because i can see like these different browns and blues i really use them a lot so that is the glitter headers and then i picked up three glitches and then one color club so let's go ahead and do the first one this was her mystery kit for april mystery kit for last year and this is a full, this is her, it should be her ultimate kit. Yeah, this is her ultimate kit. So everything that she offered with it, we received in the, in the glitch. Okay, so here this is called Cleaning Spree. I just like the colors. I think it's super cute. And um, I may not use it this year, but I will definitely put it in lineup for like next year. But it was, like I said, super cute and I I liked it. Doing your little checklist of things that you need to do from having like a big, a big spring clean day. So there are the full boxes. And then you have the um, heart full boxes. 
and then you get two extra boxes she loves putting animals in her kits um i'm not i'm, I'm not a cat fan guys <laughs> so um i think she has extra ones where i won't need to use that one but these are cute it's been a minute since i've seen her new format so i love these little flags right here i love these boxes this is a nice page i really like this page right here and then you have the different pattern solid boxes different shapes and sizes and then like her functional page yeah it's been a minute since i've seen her her um format now i don't know if this format has changed since then but i like it glitter headers are already in there bottom washi i do love that she gives you like three different um sizes and colors and then the one thing i don't care for with her subscriptions is her foil um her overlays i i'm i'm just not a fan of her um overlays um i think this goes like this to me it's just a lot it's yeah it is it's like a lot for me so i probably won't use the overlays so there's that and then we also get more labels And then more box, this like double box scene here. Would love this in my house. And then the fashion girls. And from my understanding, she doesn't put fashion girls in her kits anymore. From what I'm, from what I'm hearing on that. And then again, you have some overlays as well. So this was the April Mystery 2022, and I am happy with that um obviously i purchased it so i still like it and i'm going to use it next up is her miss her october 22 mystery and i feel like i've seen this maybe somebody else has, has shown it but it's called apple orchard apple orchard and i'm definitely going to put this in my i'm going to try and put this in my fall kit lineup for this year Now, with her mysteries, I feel like they are very, I can't pull this out. I feel like they are very um, hit and miss for me. So that's why I don't do her mysteries anymore. I rather, when she offers like this glitch sale, I rather just take advantage at that time and just get something that I know that I'm going to like. So uh, I'm going to go quickly because this should be the same format, but here are the full boxes. I love the, I love the muted colors. So very pretty. Definitely gives me that country fall vibe. Um, the squirrel is kind of cute. Um, I think those are apples. Maybe let me get a sip of my coffee before it gets cold. Okay. All right. So here we have the full boxes heart boxes i like this little that i love that little old truck sink old little truck you always see that at hobby lobby love these colors these colors are actually very cute love the colors a lot love that double box scene i would definitely use that again same format nothing has changed it looks like love these colors love this this is pretty very very pretty love them just really do love these colors and then those overlays if i wanted to i can add them on here okay so this one here let's see what we got so here's the overlays for the um boxes okay and then what else i'm missing some things okay here we are let's do this here and then here is the double box scene and then i will probably use the bottom overlays for this and maybe even use the overlays for that we'll see and then we also received additional labels and then i'm missing something down here oh, these are the fashion girls where you just kind of get their outfit 
and then them holding an apple super pretty love this a lot as well so this is apple orchard and this was october 2022 mystery love that okay next this was not a mystery at all but this is dear santa i thought this was super cute gives me that traditional um christmas i can't remember if this is a ultimate or a mini so we're gonna take a look and see i know this was from last year for sure okay so here are the full boxes this is so pretty i love i love i love the colors and then you have your heart boxes okay same setup same layout love the two double box well extra boxes there love the little stripes gives you that candy cane vibe like the extra little you can do these as labels or headers however you want to do that i think these are like considered as littles and then your glitter headers love the colors sidebar goodies bottom washi and then the double box and that is absolutely stunning so that is dear santa hopefully that will fit into my lineup for this year and then next a color club and i'm just here for the colors for the colors she always does like an abstract type of full boxes or you can even just use this as a kit if you wanted to and then you have the labels again i just like to use these in my um whatchamacallit my um content planner headers little things and then we are back to the beginning so that is my order from glam planner okay next up who do we have because I have the names backwards. Okay, this is from Creating and Co. Creating and Co. And she is known for her book type theme goodies. And here's a journaling card. I'm not a bookworm. I'm a book dragon. So I picked up like some functional type things from her. She, I think she was in the latest PDC sale. I believe it was. okay so there we got my receipt okay so let's see here we have a reading royalty 2023 creating and co events i guess like reading royalty challenges she does them like each um season and then she has reading a thons and she always does like a huge um event for like she'll do kits and things like that that coordinates with it and then I have like this little die cut too many books and not enough time and then i picked this up to put in my a5 and i think it's sticker so i can keep track of the books that i have read for 2023 super cute Okay, then here is a freebie. And then I picked up these typewriters. Don't know why. I just thought they were super cute and I'll figure out how to use them. And then I picked up some more icon, some more book icons and like the springy summer type colors. And then also I wanted to get something that I can write, uh, write my books. And then I picked up Start Reading and 
finished reading in this style. And then I picked up start re reading and finished reading. Hold on, where's that? In this style. And then she had these little movie night type labels, which I thought were super cute. And then the large TVs, especially if I'm binging something all day or whatever, I like to use these as well. I should have picked up two sheets of those. But that is my order from Creating & Co. Okay, next up we have the Giving Girl. She was having a sale that I didn't realize. Um, her packaging is always super cute. All right, so I went in because I love her bowstring boxes. And if you watch my videos, then you know I like to use these to mark work. And so I know that she said, I remember her posting that she wasn't going to be making those anymore. And so I was like, you know what? Let me go in and just bite the bullet and get what I can. But before we get into all of this, let's go ahead. And she also had an oops bag that I decided to go ahead in. This is the oops bag variety that I decided to go ahead in and check out. Okay, so remember these boxes, I do have these. So you can use these as like a habit tracker if you want it to. And then I do have these. These are from her advent calendar back in 2021. I haven't used these yet though. And then this is from a kit called Carnival. And I may put this, I think I have a carnival type kit that I may put this, but I think the colors will go great. Look at that. I love that. That is so cute. Look at that icon. Love the chair. Love the detailing of, look at that car. Love the detailing of her icons. And then these cloud type um, bowstring boxes in silver. And then this was from that same, I still have these. This is from that same giving the 2021 box laptops. And then you have the snowflake numbers in silver, which is very nice. And this is, what is this? It's called queen, I guess dangling spider numbers okay so put this with my fall and then these are different i've seen these before i just haven't used them yet uh, this is starry line numbers and then you have like these bow seals and then this is from a kit from november cute i could probably use this in my in my personal and then i don't have this kit but it's called change so i may be able to pull this in right here for something so i'll say i will save it because i may be able to pull this in for um like a, my memory spread when i'm doing the date dots or date covers so that is the oops bag and i'm not mad at it there are some things in here that i can definitely and then this little typewriter. And then this is a, is it a three year five? It's a, I can't see, I don't have my glasses on. It's either a five year or three year with all orders. Cute, great for journaling. And then, did I pick this up? I can't remember if I picked this up or not, but cute, like for journaling. Okay, and then I guess I picked these up. I can't remember, but I can't remember. 
Okay, so this is, yeah, this is uh, the Flight Cluster uh, Deco, and I, this is also from 2021, so I should still have these in the, like the butterfly in gold. And then the Pumpkin Fairy Lights go into my fall collection and then I did I do remember picking up these these little snowberries I thought this was perfect for uh, for the fall and I'm sorry for the winter and these are like her crystal dangling ones and this is variety number 11 snowberry and then I picked up the um, I forget which is this mid tins I don't know which color this is but again that in that winter time, Christmas time. And then this is without it. I picked up all these little different boxes. I should have kept those together. I didn't do a very good job of that. And I could just use these for like layering pieces and all of that good stuff. Okay, so on to my why I was really there for. And so this is Sunkissed in Rose Gold. Like I said, she was very, very low. She did not have a lot of options. So I went and picked up everything that I could. So here we have, again, the Sunkissed in the, um, this is Bow Sampler 2.0. I don't remember these. I don't think I have any of this style. And then this is the original style that I have. Carnival in gold i also was able to get it in silver and then skyline in gold and rose gold and then smoky amethyst in gold rose gold And then jewel and gold. These all kind of look a little bit the same, a little bit. And silver and rose gold. And then sweet and silver, rose gold. And then back to the beginning. So that is my order from the Giving Girl. Okay, next we have an order from Buttercream Stickers. She's on Etsy and she is a new to me shop. I found her through another fellow YouTuber and I definitely will be going back because I, I love her stuff. So let me move my receipt there. Okay, here is a journaling card, sorry. I forgot what I purchased. Okay, so here we have a journaling card. And then I picked up some icons. You can never have too many icons, I'm just saying. Okay, so let's see what I got here. I got TVs, because I'm always marking TV in my planner. So I think I picked up all three colors because I don't think I really have a whole lot in silver and rose gold. So, um, um, and I just did a big order with Crafts by Talby as well, but I don't remember if I picked up TVs. So I picked up all three of her TV console volume two in all three colors. And then I picked up some cameras. And I think I did, I uh, mean, did I not get silver? Okay, I guess I didn't get silver. So I picked up two in gold and then one in rose gold. Don't know why I didn't get silver. Maybe because I had a bunch and that's probably why. I try to look at what I have to determine what foil colors I need. Okay, and then I did the coffee cups, 0.2 in silver and rose gold. And then I did books with like the coffee cup in silver, rose gold, and then bathtubs in rose gold. 
So those were the icons. And then this must have been a freebie. And then I also picked up work scripts, which I'm glad because I'm getting low on the silver and rose gold. So I picked up uh, rose gold. Her rose gold is, I get, I feel like it's like a more of a coppery color. And then silver. Now this kit is frigging stunning. It reminds me of Tinkerbell and I believe they're doing a Tinkerbell live action. And so I'm gonna save this kit for that. Um, I really need a Little Mermaid kit. Um, I haven't seen something like that for this. So if you know someone that did a Little Mermaid kit, um, definitely let me know in the comments and I will definitely check it out. So this is called Fairy Wishes. I just think this kit is so, 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 so stunning. So you have your full boxes and then you have like little swatches down here and this is in gold and then you have your box page i'm glad that not everything has foil on it you do have someone that does not and she gave you a variety of different shapes and sizes and the colors and then you have like some boxes like solid boxes down here and then you have two sets of headers, a little bit of deco, more layering pieces. These are cute. Love those. I love the little stamps, torn paper. And then the bottom washi. And then more layering boxes, date covers, habit trackers. This is really pretty. And then I also picked up the large deco. Isn't this cute? Oh my goodness. I cannot wait to use this. And then that's it. And then I also picked up the, um, like the florals. So that is my order from buttercream stickers and she is on Etsy. Oh, and I also got some date dots too. Cool. I didn't see those. Maybe they come with the kit. All right, so I'm super excited for that. And then next up, who do we have? Wild Summer Designs. She was having a vault sale again. And so I picked up some oldie but goodies from her. And this time I did the full kits. I think the last time I didn't realize what she was doing as, and so I picked up the minis and I wanted the the full kits okay so this I do have this kit right here in an from another shop but it's called coffee date I love me a good um coffee kit so here are the full boxes this is it's supposed to be like premium matte it's not as vibrant I will say so this is a kit where I will probably do like some overlays just to make it pop a little bit more but I'm still going to use it okay so here you have the full boxes and then the bottom washi got an extra box here date covers and then like all the, the different boxes. Now I will say I definitely need to do overlays for her glitter headers because they're just kind of blah. I will say that. Um, but heck, this kit only cost me like eight bucks. So I can make this pop. That's fine. That's not a big deal. And then you have more boxes. more boxes and labels and then that is that kit and then here we have spring shopping totally forgot about this kit i've seen this artwork before a little maybe a year or two ago and i thought it was super cute i don't think i had i don't think i ever purchased it so i wanted to go ahead and pick it up I have some og type kits here same format but again um definitely need to bring in some overlays for this kit i like that box right there i do like the abstract of the bottom washi it's different 
And then I guess this is like considered your functional. Your glitter headers and more labels, more boxes. More labels and boxes. And that's it. Okay, so I guess I just picked up two kits from, yeah, I think that was all that I saw. And here is my order from Wild Summer Designs. Next we have station stickers. And I wanted to pick up some things that I was low on that I liked from her shop that I needed. I can't remember if she was having a sale or not. When people are having sales, I take advantage, especially if I've had my eye on things. That's kind of how I can save me a little bit of money and also support. Okay, so here is my little journaling card or my thank you card. And then I have like this little freebie that I will save. And then this uh, freebie as well and like transparent. It says March for 2023. Okay, let's get into my scripts. So she has maybe, I think, four or five different fonts that you can choose from. And so I could, again, I went in and just picked up some things that I, I wanted to get. I, also, I was definitely out of clean kitchen, so I used that a lot. So I wanted to pick up another set of uh, this and just the, the, the regular um, non-foil. And then quick clean. And I did script B. And then I, again, film. So I got that in rose school, which I'm glad now I've got two sheets of that. Silver and script C. And then edit. I'm always doing that as well. And I picked that up in silver and rose gold. Perfect. Again, see, I totally forgot what I was doing. Um, and then I don't think I had meal plan and rose gold or silver. So I wanted to go ahead and pick those up as well. I'm pretty, I'm hoping that's what I did. Again, it's been a minute. So we have meal plan and script C for silver and rose gold. And then I did meal prep and silver and rose gold. Nope, I just did silver. I just did rose gold. Okay. All right, and then I picked up some icons. I did laundry and silver and rose gold. I think it's because I just didn't have these. And then I did the trash icons in silver and rose gold, it looks like. And then I picked up like this variety one. And I think I picked it up in silver as well. You know, you have just those, you, you, um, you're planning and you just don't have that particular icon. So I like to, I always like to try to pick up a variety. So that way, you know, if it's on here, I don't have to buy like a full sheet, especially if it's something that I just don't do. So rose gold and silver. And then this was like, I forget this one was called, but this was group seven, I think. And again, I picked that up in rose gold and silver. And then I picked up this little um, deco with the book with the flowers coming out of the book. I thought that was super pretty. And then we are back to the beginning. So that is my order from Station Stickers. And I'm glad that I'm doing this haul because I hope I don't, I didn't purchase any of this again that I don't need as of right now. So, but I do need this in those colors and I'm glad that I picked those up. Okay, next up we have Sadie Stickers. Okay, this was a $2 Tuesday. I love when she does functional type items and I can't remember if this was a sale or not, but I don't remember what I did. So let's see. Again, this was a while ago. All right, so she came out with like these um, 
uh, swatch boxes in different watercolors. I did not purchase all of them. I purchased the ones that I thought that I would use the most, but I do want to go back and maybe get some of the other colors. So before I put this away, I'm going to make a list of the ones that I already have. So that way I'm not going back and buying them again, especially if I don't need them. So this is alabaster and I decided to pick up like the rectangle type um, midi box or midi swatches and this is again alabaster and then i also picked up the oval boxes i prefer the oval really over the square so i should have i should have gotten the boxes and the ovals for the colors that i chose okay so then we have this is honeydew And then I chose lavender. Like I said, I do wanna go back and get the other colors. This is lemon chiffon. And this is misty rose. Super excited for those. And then what else did I pick up? I think she did, I think she was also doing a bring back maybe, possibly. Again, it's been a hot minute. Okay, so this is the flower layering garland. And then I picked up, this is in gold, and then I picked up this one in the, in rose gold. And here we have a freebie from Shanice. So Shanice 20. And I know their, their, um, their um, I can't think, their freebies have changed now. I like the days of the week. Very, very functional. Okay. So then I can't see guys. This is the flower, flower droop garland. And I got it in, I think all three foils. Rose gold, silver, and gold. And then this is the flower, another garland in all three colors. This is gonna be fun putting this away. <laughs> and then you guys know I love the little um, dividers. And I picked those up in all three colors. And then I love the clusters. This is the flower cluster. You, they're so tiny. You couldn't, be, you wouldn't be able to see it anyway in the planner. So, um, I also per got those in all three foils. And then I picked up these stamps. And then these mini blossoms in gold. And did I get them in all three colors? I did. So that is part of that $2 Tuesday. And then I picked up some deco. I bet this was for June. I bet you this was for June. I'm almost positive it was. Okay, so this is from her uh, kit called Steps. I picked up the deco page from there. And I picked up the journal sheet. I want to say this was for my, um, what's it called? My um, content planner. I'm almost positive. And then also she had the swatches, the alcohol ink swatches. Now I definitely want to go back and get these as well. I want to start using these in my memory spreads. I just don't see me using these in my A5. A5 is more so very, very functional. So um, I definitely purchased these for um, my um, memory spreads. And I wanna say I got them in all the colors that I had earlier. So this is um, alabaster. Okay, 
and then uh, honeydew and I did pick them up in transparent and then lavender and lemon chiffon and misty rose so yes I picked them up in the same colors and I definitely like I said I definitely want to go back and pick up the rest of the colors and especially in the um, ink swatches so I'm really excited about that and yeah so that is my order from Sadie stickers do I have another one from Sadie stickers okay I have another order from Sadie stickers I think this was the the late the latter one and then this is the newest one and yeah okay so this is another two dollar Tuesday now this would I think this might have been the bring me back I think this was the bring me back and not the one prior yeah I want to say this was definitely the bring me back okay all right I almost kind of prefer the bring me back because it kind of saves money on shipping okay but it is overwhelming because you're trying to figure out what you bought before and all that good stuff so here we have uh, these are the classic lace washi so I picked up gold did I pick up all three no I did not I picked up rose gold and gold and then now I'm upset that I didn't get these in gold but these are so cute these fences why didn't I not pick these up in the gold okay so there's that okay and then these are floral combo garlands in rose gold and gold and then I picked up the butterfly mini dangle deco in gold I was trying to be selective on like okay let me get something gold let me get something in rose gold and let me get something in silver that's kind of how my mentality was and then butterfly in rose gold again I can use these throughout because they're so daggone tiny and then oh these are date dots okay these are date dots and then these butterflies are so cute rose gold please tell me I got those in gold I did awesome and then I wanted um, and then these are like the butterfly mini circles and oh okay I did get the I'm sorry okay Woo. okay I'm sorry I didn't get the bigger sheet in these um, but I also, okay so I did get the fences um, in gold in the smaller sheet and then I picked up this garland in gold and then this garland in rose gold and then some more deco clusters in gold and then I did these bicycles in rose gold and then this was a freebie for Tay. I think this is the latest one. Super pretty. And then these are super cute. These little window balconies in gold. And then I did the little Ascot scooters. Or the scooters, not Ascot. The scooters in gold. And then the little floral brick texture type things in gold. And then these little hot air balloons in gold. And then these string lamps in gold. Okay, and then I thought I didn't have these. I have a strawberry kit. And I was like, okay, let me finish getting what I need. And I think I already have these. I'm almost positive that I already have this. Because I think I was going to use the strawberry kit this summer. So this was the um, 
this is her old format the way she used to do it and then the floral I picked up two florals and then the boxes okay so that is my order from Sadie stickers and then last but not least we have a new to me shop and this is called she is called mojo 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 of jojo plants so i have been watching different youtubers use these books and i you guys know that i'm getting super super low on my labels that i like to put into my content planning planner and so she came out with some new ones i'm all about seeing things like somebody else showing them okay and then also looking and saying okay is this something that i'm going to be able to use um and all of that good stuff so i decided to choose two different ones and i know like she'll sell out and then she'll like restock i think these these books cost about twenty dollars so I picked up the pastel boxes and then the monthly pastel boxes. This is bo a number. This one here is 522. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at that one. I might have to do it to the side so you guys can see it. Okay, so I'm going to flip it this way so that way you guys can see it. Some of these boxes I may not be able to use, but I'm gonna figure it out. And then I, um, this is the size that I'm probably gonna be using a lot, and maybe this size right here. So you have like the orangey type color. Okay, you get two pages of that. And then you have the different sizes here. And then you have some line ones. Again, I could probably maybe use this in my focus area down there. I may try it out. And then the bigger ones in the solid without the lines. And then we go into another color palette. You have like a yellow and like a, what color is it? Like a tannish color. Same format. So now I'm going to flip through the colors, lines, and then without the lines, and then you have like a green mint color. I just don't know how I'm going to use these bigger boxes, but I wanted these this size right here. So, but I'm going to figure it out. And then like a bluish color, blue tealish color. Lots of boxes. Again, the lines. And then without the lines. And then you go into purple, purple lavender. And then you have your lines. Oh, so I was going to say, oh, please tell me I have a pink. <laughs> and then you have like two shades of pink. And then you have the lines. And then with that is the pastel. And my battery is getting ready to go. So then the next one. This is the monthly. This is 940. In case you guys are wondering. So then this is for like the Happy Planner um, monthly boxes there. So I can use these there. So this is format is just a little bit different. Again, these are my favorites down here. And again, I'm going to try and figure out how to use those other boxes. I think same colors, it looks like almost. I'm going to go a little bit faster. You have green. Okay, this is a little bit different. Then you have green and yellow. Then you have that blue color. And 
Then you go into the purple. So almost the same colors that I have, which is not bad because then I can pull from here. Then got a little bit of mixture, which is nice. The different shades of pink. Mixed in with the purple. Now this is what I was really wanting, really wanted this page right here. Like I would take a whole book of these. Perfect. Then you have the green and the yellow. Like the tealish color, purple, the purple and the pinks. Yeah, I'm gonna like this book a lot. Okay, so I'm going to put everything together as much as I can and I'll be right back. Okay, I cannot fit everything in here, but thank you guys again so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please give me a big thumbs up. I will have all the list of the shops that I have shared with you down below in the subscription box. If you are new, welcome. I hope you decide to stick around and join my YouTube family. And if you are an OG, welcome back. I'm so glad you are here. And until next time, guys, I will see you in my next video and I will talk to you soon. Bye.